Good afternoon, and we're going to be having another go at the horrible Cfax-esque organ trail. Um, I didn't think I was ever going to play this game again, but what the hell I paid for it, so I'm determined to get a bit more use from it, and if I'm going to suffer it, so are you. So we're literally picking up where we left off. I did start watching the previous video, but I couldn't actually bring myself to get to the end of watching it, because it was so boring. So, we'll hopefully continue that with what we're doing today. Just going to click to continue. So I can't remember what we were doing or what led up to us being here. Um, but we can buy and sell stuff, so let's see if... Okay, we've got no money, so that, that makes it easy. We're not going to be buying anything. We could sell things um, to get money. What have we got? We've got fuel, but we're going to need that. I think we're probably going to need all these things. I think it'd be foolish to start selling ammo and med kits, if I remember correctly. Um, most people in the car seem to have a habit of strangely picking up things like gonorrhea and typhoid while sat in the back of a car, so I don't think we can take any risks selling med kits. We're going to need ammo to shoot zombies to pick up more things. We're going to need food to stay alive. Scrap, I think we need to fix the car. If we don't have fuel, we're not going anywhere, so I don't know what we'd actually buy if we were to sell it anyway. So I think we'll just stroll on, really. Party? Let's have a party. Okay, bollock chops. I think that might be me. <laughs> I'm not sure. Bungle, George, Zippy and Trotsky. George is a bit unwell. So can we... Can we, uh... Patch him up? Oh, we can. We've just done it. Okay. Should we patch everyone up? That seems like a fair way of doing things. Okay, so it's probably all of our med packs gone now. Should we talk to a stranger? I'm not sure what caused all this. If it were a virus, how did it speed so fast? And why are we immune? Are we immune? Well, we're not immune to fucking typhoid and everything else. Hence why we need all these med kits, but... I don't know how this virus did speed so fast. So, that wasn't really very helpful. Um, kill? Should, can we kill? If you're worried about an infected survivor turning and causing harm to the rest of your party, you can put them down. Infected survivors usually only become zombies when they're out of health. Infected members are shown with a green icon. So nobody's infected yet. But I mean, I suppose we could still kill George. Oh shit, have we just done that? Oh no, we've killed George. <laughs> Can we go back? Can we go back? I don't think we can. <laughs> oh, there's more food for the rest of us. Oh no, we can. We can say I can't do it. Or shall we do it? We've come this far. That's more food for the rest of us. We don't need him gobbling up our medikits any longer. And we don't want him getting athlete's foot in the back of the car, spreading that round. Oh, should we do it or not? Yeah. Liz is here, and she says yes. That you're you're a fucking animal. Go on, you do it. You you push. You pull the trigger, Liz. Come on. So it's my my better half. No, you got to pull the trigger. That's just saying you're going to do it. My better half, Liz, is. You got to point the gun in the right direction. No, that's exactly how you don't do it. Okay, I can't do it. Literally, she can't do it. She she can't point the gun in the right direction. So George lives another day because of uh, Liz's cat-handed gun skills. But uh, I'm sure she only did that because she didn't really want to see him die. <laughs> okay, so let's let's fuck off of here. I don't know where we are, uh, but let's go. Leave town. You won't be able to return. That sounds a bit final, doesn't it? But we don't want to spend forever wherever it is we are. 254 miles to the farmland. Are we are we going to the farmland then? Okay. Why? I don't know. It's a very slow car. A thief stole three scrap from your car. How? We're travelling. We're, we're moving along. What is he? Holding on to the bottom of the car or something? I don't understand how that can happen. Unless the thief's in the car. Maybe the thief is George. You find a backpack with some canned food in it. What? In the car? There's several holes in this pl to this plot, but... 
The sky clears up, so it's not raining. It looks, looks like it's night time. The car's a bit bollocks. Bungle has typhoid. Bungle, you're a fucking nuisance. How do you get typhoid sat in the back of a car? You rummage 46 food off a body at the side of the road. Well, that's good. Come on. You found some wild fruit. Well, it's just a non-stop party. Probably going to give us all typhoid. Okay, what's that little church? You rummage one battery off a body at the side of the road. Battery's good. We can use that to electrocute Bungle. trucking on. So we're at the farmland. Doesn't look like a great place to be, to be honest. It really doesn't. Hmm. Okay. Well, we're there anyway. Uh, surrounded by lots of smelly looking people with smelly bags. Okay, so... So we sell things? Jobs? What's a job? Defense, I'm having trouble sleeping. I keep seeing movement outside. Come protect me. Do that for three fuel. I don't know. Is that a good idea? Do we dispose of bandits for $18? I guess we should do something. What's a combat trainer? The grizzled stranger beckons you to a dark corner and offers to teach you some useful techniques for $80. Sorry, I'm drinking tea. Um, $80, that's a lot of money. And we don't have $80, so... You can fuck off, can't you? Um, maybe we should do jobs, because... I don't know if we really want to be selling things. We don't really have an awful lot to sell. Okay, let's do a job. Ah, we need to fix the car as well. Look, it's getting tired. So, this is a really... If I remember correctly, there's a bit of a knack to doing this. So we have 27 scrap. We're going to just use two at a time, because... I don't have an awful lot of faith in my ability to do it correctly, so... Oh god, what is it? <coughs> miss, miss! Oh, what the fuck? Okay. I'm gonna fuck that up. You scrap... Okay, let's try it again. Two, one... I've got this. Boom! Boom! Perfect! Well, not perfect. Nearly perfect. So... We fixed the car a bit. A little bit. Not very much though, has to be said. Let's try it once more. One. Boom. 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 Hmm. That wasn't so good, was it? So time passes. Okay, so the car's a little bit fixed. Can we upgrade it? Find upgrades. To you can find upgrades to the car in the city auto shops and infrequently whilst travelling on the road. Did we not find a battery? Is that a car battery? I don't know how we use it or if we can use it. There must be some purpose for it. Uh, set pace. What's this? Basically, travel will affect your car. Take it slow and steady at 30. Uh, well, the car seems to be falling apart at quite a fast rate, so I think we'll just keep it slow for now. Um, road map? Okay, so we started there. Okay. I didn't know all this. I didn't know all this happened. This existed. So we've travelled 940 miles. We've been through two cities. We're at a landmark. And we're, we're going to have to get through this radioactive area before we get to Oregon. The Holy Land. I don't know why we're so desperate to get to Oregon. Supply well, scavenge. This is good. This is... Well, it's not good, but you need to do it. It's rubbish, actually. Um, I can't remember the controls. This is going to be a problem. Use wazard or arrow keys to move. Pull back to aim. Release to shoot. Oh, dear. I'm going to die, aren't I? Um, what weapon do we want? Rifle, single shot, quick reload, shotgun, spread shot, slow reload. Hmm, don't know. Uh, pistol, four quick shot, longer reload. Oh, I don't know. Let's go with the one in the middle. Okay, we've got something there. 
but if I, actually that's right, last time we did this we just basically gave them the run around. We managed okay. That looks like some ammo there. Oh. I thought we got away with that. We clearly didn't. Okay, I've been injured. How badly injured am I? Oh, not too bad. Bungle's worse off, but... We're going to put him up against the wall and shoot him if he doesn't get himself better soon. So... Let's, let's try scavenging again, because... We need to cack that up a bit. Is that a thing to collect, or is that just a bit of... scenery? That looks like something worth collecting down here. God, they move at a bit of a rate, don't they? Are we going to be able to get away with giving them this run around? Maybe. We're collecting quite a lot of stuff, which is good. I don't know what any of it is. Okay, well... What's scavenging been injured? So all we collected was food. I was sure we picked up ammo. Or maybe that's because I got injured, I don't know. A bit confused. Uh, yeah, we're a bit more injured now, so... We're going to give ourselves a medikit. Sod the rest of them. Um, the car's not in too bad a state. Our supplies aren't too bad. The town... Should we try a job? Hmm. Let's do a job. Um... Pull back to aim, release to shoot. Oh god. Oh my god. Whoa, this is mad. Um. Hmm. Okay, that went really badly. Okay, how badly injured am I as a result of that? Yeah, a bit injured. Right, let's go. Let's go, let's move on. Maybe we'll find something good at the side of the road. A bike gang follows you out of the settlement. Oh, that's exciting. Oh, they're bandits. Um, use wazard or arrow keys to move. Bandits will try to pull up next to you and shoot, crash into them to knock them off of their bikes. Oh my word. Have it. Have it. Oh, this is great fun. This is... Oh, this is the best part of the game. Oh, I like this. I bet I'm buggering up my car every time I'm doing this, I suppose. Boom. Wow, at least I found a part of this game I'm good at. It's getting a bit trickier now. But I'm holding my own. Oh, shit. Yeah, just about. There's a lot of them. They're like kamikaze motorcyclists. But we did well. Even if we're shit at most other things. 192 miles to Chicago. So. Chicago, here we come. George has measles. Well, of course he does. Well, at least, was it Bungle that had typhoid? Is that right? Bungle no longer has typhoid, but George has measles. God, it's awful back there. So... Bungle has measles. They're all getting measles. Oh no, didn't mean to put stop. Oh well, we're stopping. Don't know why, and I don't know where we are. Though it kind of looks like Chicago in the background, or at least how I imagine Chicago would be re represented in a very lo-fi game such as this. Oh, okay. Shall we talk to a stranger? I don't know who is issuing these commands to let the nukes loose. Probably some fat cat safe in a bunker somewhere. While well, we run from safe zone to safe zone, dealing with the nuclear fallout. At least they have the courtesy to warn us. Oh, is that the area we saw that had the hazard marks on it? 
maybe that's where they're nuking. No. Okay, well, let's just get on with it, shall we? Um, it starts raining. You have to drive more slowly. That's fine with me. I'm not in a rush to get anywhere. Um, I'm not sure what you're going to do about George and Bungle and their measles. The sky clears up. That looks welcoming, doesn't it? Ugly hand. So, the Windy City. I don't know what to do here, really. Um, we haven't got any money. We could sell something. I don't know what we're going to sell. We, we do have a lot of food. How much do we get for food? One dollar for ten. Okay, let's do that just for the sake of it. Um... We probably are going to need another medikit, so maybe we should buy another. Oh, we can't. We don't have enough. Um. Okay. Let's see if there are jobs. Should we try and protect them? It wasn't really worth it just for ammo, was it? Oh well, we're doing it now. I don't. I can't remember the, how to really. I'm not sure if I ever did get the hang of shooting. This is actually much harder than it looks. Uh, are you going to shoot or what? Oh shit. Oh god. Oh, this is a stressful game. There's just no reward in it, is there? There's absolutely no reward anywhere. It's so bleak, it's, you just don't want to do anything. We, we might as well leave. Really? There's nothing for us here. And if Bungle dies, then great. Just more food for the rest of us. And George as well. Fuck him. Trotsky talks about a time before all this started. Everyone is sombre. Good for him. Uh, you see the grave of some poor soul buried at the side of the road. Will you stop and look? Well, of course I'm not going to stop and look. It's a zombie apocalypse. Why would I get out of the car to look at a dead body? So no, I'm not. Right. You took a wrong turn. I haven't taken any turns. I've just been on this one road the whole time. So I guess that means it's going to take longer to get to the next stop. George no longer has measles. To be honest with you, I'm beyond caring. They're not getting any more of my med packs. Rumbling sound comes from behind you. Oh, it's not George, is it? Bungle no longer has measles. Was that the rumbling noise, was it? Oh, okay, there's another one of these things. Okay, so there's more bandits. Oh my god, our car is bollocksed! It's not bandits, it's reindeer. Reindeer and puppy dogs. And our car is knackered. I think we have to avoid them, not drive into them. Because our car is going to be absolutely fucked. Boss fight, it says. So despite the very urgent sounding music, this isn't very much fun and it doesn't feel very urgent to play. Yeah, that was pretty uninspired. Right. The remote shack. Oh, that sounds like a good fucking place to stay, doesn't it? But um, I think there's a bit of an Evil Dead reference going on there. It looks a bit like Ash with his chainsaw. Uh, it doesn't look too dissimilar to the, the hut where they find the tape with the incantations on it. And of course, the Book of the Dead. But I don't need to explain the whole plot of the film to you now. 
So it's just another dreary little stop and shop, isn't it? That's all it is. Um, maybe I should persevere with these. But no, I, I just get killed. Uh, we're going to have to fix up the car. There's no two ways about that. Can we upgrade it? No, we can't. We've already looked into this. We're definitely going to have to repair it. Let's use eight scrap. Let's put all our eggs in one basket. See how we do. Well, not too bad. Not too bad. That said, it's not, it's not fixed the car a whole lot. We're going to have to do that again. Let's see if we can do it even better. Okay, that's pretty cool. Hey, excellent. So, I'm getting the hang of this. Okay, we don't have much scrap left, so the car's going to have to... Hmm, okay, well, we're going to have to... We're going to have to scavenge, to be honest. Because we don't have any scrap left, we don't have um, any medipacks left. So I'm really going to have to do my best here. I might actually have to do some shooting instead of just giving them the run around, hoping... Oh God, they're stuck in a tree. I don't really like shooting though, to be honest. Oh God, that was a... I didn't actually mean to do that. That was an extraordinary piece of luck. Um, and I don't want to become injured. I need to get away from here because I don't want to have to waste the med pack. And I suspect that I'm not picking up or coming back with everything that I picked up because I was injured. Shit, that was very close. So all we're doing is scavenging for food. That's a bit disappointing. I, I need to be scavenging for other things. Maybe we really need to start selling some food. Let's sell some food. What's 21 of your dollars for one of their muffler? What do I need a muffler for? Do I need a muffler? I don't have 21 dollars, so no. That was easy. Um, um, should we rest? How long should we rest for? Let's rest for five hours. Is that going to help everybody? It does help everybody. It helps everybody. That's better than using med packs. That's for sure. And the food goes down, but that's fine. We've still got tons of food. So actually, I think we should sell some food. Let's sell... Let's sell 120 food. So we've got $17. Okay, well, I feel like we're sort of making some sort of... Well, I was going to say progress. But maybe, maybe some sort of progress. Anyway, let's head back on the road. It's 312 miles to St. Louis. You notice something going on a ways off from the road. Will you get out and have a look? Oh, I don't know. I keep saying no to all these things, but maybe I should enter into the spirit things and say yes. Oh, let's go. What do, you know. When you get out of the car, you hear a scuffle on the other side. You see Bungle struggling with someone. By the time you make it around to the other side, they are already holding a gun to Bungle's head. Well, I can understand where they're coming from. What's their life worth to you? It's not worth anything to me. Take the shot. I don't care. Oh, shit. This is... Ah, oh, this is really difficult. Oh well, <laughs> I missed. Well, Bungle's, um, it's the end of Bungle. Oh well, like I said, more food for the rest of us. Rumbling sound comes from behind you. Um, okay, is this more dodging reindeer? Or are these bikers? Oh, yes. 
goats and dogs and things. I assume that each time this happens it's going to get a little bit harder. That's usually the way that these things work. But um, it's all pretty sedate to be honest. Uh oh. That was a bit tricky. So yeah, we are getting our cart a little bit knackered. Oh shit. Quite knackered. So there's me saying it's too easy. But um, it's not that it's easy, it's just boring. Boring, boring. Right, the car's fucked. We're going to have to stop and fix it. Okay, we don't have very much scrap. We have to make the best of whatever we get out of this. Which wasn't very good. In fact, that sucked. Um... We're going to have to scavenge. We need... We need lots of scrap. Does that scrap I'm heading towards? It looks like something like that. That looks like ammo down there. But when I collected what looked like ammo before, I just came back with food. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, we've got ten scrap. Um, so... Okay, I'm going to need a rest, because I'm pretty damaged. Tempting to go out and scavenge again, actually, because um, we do need more scrap. And we're getting a bit low on food, so I think we are going to go and scavenge again. I can't get the hang of this shooting. Any time I try shooting, it just goes badly wrong. You can't move while you're shooting, which makes it even tougher. Come on, where's the loot? Where's the loot? Show me the loot. I don't know what that is up there, but it's going into my satchel. There seem to be less zombies on this time round. Oh, for fuck's sake. The collision detection's a bit odd, isn't it? I think it is. Hmm. Okay, well we've got some... <clears throat> I'm nearly dead. Okay. That's a bit of a worry. Zippy was holding the map upside down. I'd expect nothing less of you, Zippy. I'm going to have to do something about my energy level. George was bitten by a zombie. Um, is there a way out of that? Or do I just shoot him? I'm tempted to shoot him. Very tempted to shoot him. Um, okay, we've got no medikits left now. No medikits left at all. So, actually, if George gets much worse... We are going to shoot him. Oh great, we lost some food. The car's broken down. Oh Jesus, everything's going wrong. Okay, we're going to have to fix the car, because it's just broken. We're going to have to do this well. Okay, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad at all. Let's fix it again. Let's just get it as fixed as we can. Okay, that wasn't too bad either. We fixed the car up a little bit. But now we have no scrap or anything. We desperately need to scavenge, and I need to scavenge better. A lot better. What's this over here? This looks like a driving license. Oh shit. Okay, that looks a little bit tricky to get to. Was this food over here, this one? 
Oh shit! <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we're gonna have to rest. Let's rest for... Oh, just one hour. Then we're gonna have to rest longer than that, I think. Let's rest for four hours. Get my energy back up. Why is my energy not going up? Why is everybody else's energy going up, apart from mine? That's a bit of a worry. Let's cross a horde of zombies in order to continue on the road. The horde in front of you is currently massive in size and appears to be alert. Hmm. Horde size, massive. Horde disposition, alert. That's a nice little sort of uh, summary of what they just told us in the previous screen. Wait to see if the horde disperses. Break out guns and clear a path. Attempt to sneak through. Hire mercenaries. Get information about your choices. So, maybe wait and see if the horde disappears is a good idea. Break out guns. I think the very fact it's massive means it might be a bit beyond that. I don't think we're going to sneak through, because we know that the disposition is alert. Hiring mercenaries. We've got about, you know, $15. Any mercenaries we can hire with $15 aren't going to be worth their weight in typhoid. So, I think we're just going to have to wait. Oh, it's ravenous now. <laughs> That's worse, isn't it? Information about your choices. Sneak through. Um, large and angry. Okay, that seems like a large and angry crowd. How much are mercenaries? We don't have enough money. Okay, we're going to have to wait again. Let's hope they all go home. Okay, they're just alert now. Let's wait again. Agitated. It's, it's only large. Okay, let's try and clear a path. Overrun, we lost one fuel. Oh dear, this game is so depressing. Zippy has a broken... leg. Really? He sat in the back of a fucking car. It starts raining heavily. You will have to drive more slowly. Trotsky was holding the map upside down. You go an hour out of the way. I don't know why you trust any of them with the map. This keeps happening. Sky clears up. You find an upgrade to your car in an abandoned garage. That's pretty neat, isn't it? Shall we see if we can upgrade the car? So we're at the cave. So, what's this? Repairs the car. Yeah, that's a good idea. We want that. Oh, it's already installed. Okay. So, do we have any scrap? We don't. We're going to have to scavenge again. We're pretty injured. Oh, let's just leave. Well, I think I've had enough of this for now. Um, it is a thoroughly bleak game, to be honest. There's very little reward. It seems to be a sort of never-ending spiral of existentialist doubt. Um, there doesn't seem to be any way out of this. Um, I'm kind of looking forward to shooting George, but that's about it. Well, I hope this has left you as thoroughly depressed as it has me. Um, yeah. Next time we'll see if we can play something a bit more cheerful. Well, whatever you're doing, have fun.